And we're back to yet again more Batman, the enemy within. So, uh, I feel bad about Gordon. Like, if he's just trying to do his job, but he's getting a bit too frustrated and angry. Stress is getting to him, and then practically lost his job because, yeah. We should have just told him we're Batman. We're apparently telling everyone else we're Batman. I mean, we showed Catwoman the Batcave. We told Tiffany that we're Batman. Hell, what's next? We tell John we're the Batman. I think he's starting to figure that out too, though. That's not right. The Al, should know what have you located the black site? I think so. While you were at the office, I did some basic online research on the Bundy Spa. Excellent. What's the verdict? According to reviews, it truly seems to be a fully functioning business. Uh, not just a front. Couldn't tell from the service entrance. They offer rather popular high-end massages and have an active social media feed. It's a 24-hour business, Bruce. There are customers going in and out at all times. They have no idea what's coming for them. There's no way to tell until I get in there. I'll proceed with caution. We will. Initiate the feed of my contacts to Waller. Let her know I'm here. At once. I need to see what we're up against. Good idea. Remember, you're able to toggle the thermal imaging in your lenses. I'm signing off while you speak with Director Waller. Be careful. Thanks, Al. Waller? On the line, Bruce. I'm here. I'll let you know if I find anything interesting. Caution is key, Bruce. This situation is a spark away from a wildfire. I'll keep that in mind. No. That access door is connected to the spa. That appears to just be a patron. There are still traces of heat signatures. Someone was here recently. Maybe guards. Looks like we have a receptionist behind the front desk. She's hardly anything to worry about. All too easy to hide a gun under that desk. They're heading downstairs. The real lab must be underground. Sanctus has been in the middle of Gotham this entire time. They burrow under your skin and eat you from the inside out. This is why I'm willing to let these criminals be the tip of the spear. Dangerous and expendable. My favorite adjectives. Right. I see a security panel inside the building. It could trigger an alarm system of some kind. If I can hit that before they suspect what I'm really here for. They'll be blind and helpless. Perfect for my people. You just saved a few agents' lives, Bruce. That's some top-notch field work, Bruce. I know being undercover's been tough, but you just need to maintain it a little longer. If you don't get inside with those maniacs, we're going to have a pandemic on our hands. Waller, I need to go. Now, why would a billionaire be skulking around in a filthy alley? Carefully inspecting every detail. Almost as if performing reconnaissance. 
I could ask you the same. Oh, I'm not skulking. I have a very deliberate purpose. My Bane, have you been spying on me? Spying? No. I've only been keeping an eye on you. That's so, the same thing. I heard that GCPD paid you a visit at your office, so I swung by to see if you might be in need of some aid. Innocent as that. Then, something about the look on your face as you left. So, determined. Yes, I had a sense you would lead me to something interesting. Project Lotus. This is the secret you and Harley had. Where are we, Bruce? What is this place? And do your best, to be honest. Lies insult us both. This is it. The black site Riddler wanted to hit. So this is what Harley was trying to keep secret. She didn't know. <laughs> Strange that you're here after a run-in with GCPD, in an alleyway, with the other rats. Finding you in this duplicitous position, while we have a mole problem, uh, it does not look good for you, my friend. I know it doesn't. When you wake up, you can tell Harley that you led me right to her conspiracy. This is gonna hurt. Wake up. <laughs> Nope, no option to block that. Well, that sure saw that coming. Rice and shine. what you're about to face, Wayne. You did the right thing, telling me about the Black Site. But there's still something about you that gives me pause. Something that casts a shadow over your heart. Harley wanted to spearhead the hunt for the mole. This will be her chance. So, be thoughtful with your words in there. They could be your last. Thanks for the warning. I'll be careful. I hope it's not you, Wayne. But if it is, I'll kill everyone who shows up for your funeral. What is it now, Bane? The rat has been uncovered. Wayne was right under your nose. I tracked Wayne to the location of the Black Site. He had I sent Wayne to scout it, so lower your damn voice. It was the final piece of the puzzle, and now we got it. Go get your boys ready. We move on the site ASAP. And don't worry your pretty little head about our rat problem. I got it covered. And Bane, tell Freeze to get one of them popsicle makers ready. Well, that was the thing. You're not going anywhere. You're in here. With me. Trap. Oh, hi, guys. Thanks for backing me up. Don't mention it. Can't have him stepping on my turf, you know? I said I'd find the rats, and I will. Your father, he was a hard man, right? Someone lied to him, betrayed him. He ended them. Think he was onto something with that idea? Show no mercy? Take no apologies? That sort of thing? You need to keep your people in line. Sometimes that means making hard choices. <laughs> such a pretty way of saying killing a person. I hadn't taken you for such a ruthless fella. You are who I think you are, Bruce. Who do you think I am? A man out to prove to the underworld he's just as bad as his dear departed dad. Or there more to the story I should know. Hidden depths? 
Secrets you don't want me to see. I also enjoy long walks on the beach. Hmm. <laughs> You're funny. Must have gotten that from your mother's side. You know my dad could be a funny guy too. <laughs> that fact. And they all fell down to the deep to drown. To the dark to drown. He used to sing that to me. My dad. Made me feel safe. Like nothing could hurt me. You have a nice voice. <laughs> Might want to get those ears checked, Brucey. But it's nice to know I have a fan. Been running short of those lately. In fact, you being like my dad, that's why I got such a soft spot for you. Oh, you do? You found me the black side, didn't you? Plus, uh -huh. you're not a bad guy. I mean, you're rotten like the rest of us. But, you actually care for some people. Like that girl John told me about. What's her face? Uh, Brittany? No. Tiffany. You remember? Early 20s, fresh faced and optimistic. How am I doing? Br who's. who's that? <laughs> oh, that's rich. <laughs> nice try, but you're a book. And I read ya. I'm glad you have a friend in this world, Bruce. That's invaluable. Yeah, friends are great. Except when you have to lose them. Laptop's gone. What are you? Yeah, Shaka, we have a turncoat. I've interviewed just about everyone in the place. Except maybe one. Or two. So gosh, that only leaves the two people I haven't cleared. You and Catwoman. Maybe it was the guy who Bane gave the hamburger face. But weirdest thing, the laptop went missing after that. Well, you seem to have made up your mind already. I guess one of us has to be the mole. But you've already cleared me. Trying to make me second guess myself ain't gonna work, sweetie. Nice try, though. John, get in here! When I told Puddin I narrowed it down to you two, he begged me to let him interrogate you. I gave him some pointers, and now this is his chance. Hi, Bruce. You potential rat. Have at it, John. Harley, do you mind? Can't learn to ride with training wheels on forever, you know? I'll be right outside. Hi, John. Admit it, you rat scum! You're the... the rat! <laughs> Sorry, I have to make it sound good. Do it again. What? <laughs> Do it. me again. Take that! <laughs> you hitting him already. Let it play. <sighs> I never wanted it to come to this, but we both know what has to be done. Catwoman has to take the fall. Think about it, Bruce. Harley's gonna kill that Tiffany girl if it's you, and who knows if she'll stop there. John, you stole the laptop. Well, yeah, but that doesn't make me the mole. Besides, you asked me to help you get it. And maybe you're the mole, and maybe you're not. Yeah, I asked you to get it, but I, I what can't did you lose do you. Why did, did you even you? stick up for me? I didn't say that. I tried, to Bruce. I really did. Now, I said it loud and clear. I internally. But you know, Harley, she's not a mind reader. I'm sorry. I'm not as strong as you. Well, I'll get through this, Bruce, but I don't see a lot of options that end too great for you. It's either you or her. What do you want to do, Bruce? She knows it was one of you two. She knows. And don't think I don't feel just 
awful about this. Since, you know, I stole it. Can't help but feel a little bit responsible. All right, time's up. Perfect, because I'm done. You got a confession? Great job, Puddin. Who are we hanging out to dry? Go ahead, Bruce. Tell her what you told me. Come on. Go ahead, Bruce. It's okay. Just like we talked about. Please. <sighs> it was me, Harley. I took it. You were just starting to get under my skin. Too bad. I guess I do have to hurt Tiffany after all. And you, of course. I knew you had it in you, John. We are gonna do terrible things together. Like, send this one to the great icebox in the sky. Okay. Ah, oh, well, we made our decision. Well, oh, Bruce, it's been fun. Yeah, Bane, get him inside. <laughs> you can let the cats out of the bag. Bruce, Bruce is in deep trouble. Harley, be reasonable. <laughs> Why would I start now? I got you what you wanted. I found the black side. This ain't about what it was or what you did with it. It's about trust. And I ain't got none for you no more. Wait! Harley, as great as this is as a punishment, not Bruce. You can't. Uh. He's, he's my best friend. Uh uh. Aw, Puddin. That's sweet. So, maybe we can let him go? Live, at least? Nah. <laughs> Be sure to send Tiffany a postcard from Antarctica. Well, that was fun. That's how it's ending. Seriously. <laughs> That's how it's ending. Uh, let's see. If I'm ever going to set up power in the car for you. Sure, as a few of you are going to cast into one of them. Green of her plan that you failed for good. She will be fabulous. That you gave her a little comfort to Tiffany, probably. Uh, you know, my eyes are very pale, though. You and it's only point four percent points that far you're going to see. She was like fans, but you went to the the mall. She felt just very told me that it's something people need to deal with. You felt to see when you confess to having been the mall all along. Well, oops. Uh, you and said 87 points was implied. Left him for honor to go back into the time to apologize for being a bitch. I'm honored that you would let me in on your Batman secret. You and 52.1% implied this and I feel horrified. She was on the edge after I was nervous about being so hard that she's a BD. Yeah, I sort of screwed up now. <laughs> it's like, oh yeah, by the way. You gave a warn her to piss off Gordon. I'm trying to make good of Gordon, but no, I can't seem to. She felt honored that you let her see your back cave. When you gave yourself up to protect her, she felt horrified watching what happened to you. She's worried that you might die. Well, there's still two more apps, so I don't think I can die. I mean, there's two more episodes, so...
You and 90.2% of the players that have gone through. Don't you know fight with Batman when you were nearly able to rest Catwoman? He knew you hadn't tipped her off. Could you leave when you didn't resist the rest? Because of what you said after Wall fired him. There's a little remorseful about trying to arrest you. Ah, uh, Gordon. Just wanna give him a hug. Ah, uh, ah. Uh, you and 70.4% of players left John Fair and get rid. He took to you heart your advice to manipulate others. He felt proud that he was able to help her sail by retrieving the laptop. Did you sacrifice yourself to protect your friends? He felt Get rid. Ah, ah. Poor John. So, most players warned Catwoman that the GCPD was after her. Most people side of Catwoman over Gordon. But then if I see you get John in the case. <laughs> Most people, well, most people don't manipulate people anyway. Be yourself. That that's not a joke. Did you tell Tiffany that you're Batman? Most people actually did tell Batman. So here's the thing: Did you put yourself out as the moment? Most people actually took the fall. I mean, that's a bit of a dick move, just being like, oh, well, let's put Catwoman in now. Betray her trust. Freeze her. Well. Yeah, no thank you. I mean, let's think about it for a second, Hill. Seemed like the best choice, honestly. I mean... Let's think about it. There's two more episodes, right? So it's not like we can actually die from this. Because there's two more episodes. And if we sent Catwoman, well, that would bring consequences down the line. There have been consequences down the line. It's probably going to still be eye issues. Like, the first thing I mentioned that Wall is going to be furious when he finds out. Well, let's realize something. Tiffany could very well be, you know, useful to me. I mean, someone needs to replace Lucius Fonts now. Might as well have the one who actually knows what she's doing help out Batman. I mean, good ideas. Ah, shame about Harley, though. Could have got in good with Harley, though. But, if we out a cat one, though. But, oh well. Only problem. We did get ourselves caught. That does throw the plan into a bit of a... That does screw up the plan a bit because... Yeah. We're not going to be allowed to do stuff at the black side. Oh well. But anyway, that's all for next time. Hope you all enjoyed. Thank you all and have a nice day.